October 17, 1973. Dawn of the energy crisis, as Arab oil producing nations say they will cut back on oil exports to Western nations and Japan. The result? A total embargo until the following year, bringing severe oil shortages and rising inflation to the United States and other countries. 1777, a turning point in the Revolutionary War. British forces under General John Burgoyne surrender to American troops in Saratoga, New York. The victory persuades the French to side with the Americans against the British during the war. 1989, a deadly earthquake measuring 7.1 on the Richter scale strikes Northern California. The quake kills more than 60 people, leaving 12,000 homeless and causing $6 billion in damage. 1931. Mobster Al Capone is convicted of income tax evasion and sentenced to 11 years in prison. Capone is released eight years later. And 1915. Playwright Arthur Miller, author of Death of a Salesman and the Crucible, is born in New York City. You go to the theater because it's giving you news of some kind that applies to today. And it's a rare thing that can outlast its moment. It's very difficult. Today in History, October 17th. Tim McGuire, The Associated Press.